this much of flour. This much flour. This much, no, this much flour. This much light, light, this much, this much of this. <laughs> However much sugar you want. This much vanilla extract. This much chocolate twips. Depends if they're many. If they're many, use that much. One egg. And just use some water too. Just little by little, keep pouring in water. You gingerbread man, you're making a gingerbread man. Mm. Um, so, you're gonna. That and then you can add more flour if you want and add more water if you want. I'm going to add a little more water. So that means I'm going to add a little more flour. That's a pinch. A pinch of flour. A pinch of flour. Alright, I'll see you guys in a little bit. It should be like dough. So stir until dough consistency. If you need, you can add more flour or water. Plus, right now I'm mixing with my hands. You can too, if you want. Uh, so, as I'm mixing, I'm telling you what this is making. Gingerbread man. I use chocolate chips, you don't have to. Plus, um, I'm still not done mixing, you can mix as I'm mixing, or if you're already done mixing, you can just move right, no, you can't move right along, because I'm not going to tell you until I'm actually doing it, so I will talk for a while, uh -huh. I can't go live until I get 1,000 subscribers and I get a YouTube plaque. Um, so, yeah, I hope that I can go live someday soon, and I really want to go live someday soon, I haven't ever gone live, it will be my first time, and sorry if you couldn't hear me at those first few parts, we're making gingerbread man, <laughs> plus this is not off a, a recipe, so I'm just like guessing. Uh, uh, if you're already making it, just say, okay, Mom, I'm making gingerbread man from scratch. Or if you're not making it, please don't make it. Until I tell you at the end of the day, I love making that, and uh, you can make it, you know? But if I say, I love making it, but you can't eat it, it's not edible. No, it is edible. You can eat it, but it might taste bad. But yeah. I honestly am doing this from scratch. Just like flour and stuff. I'm not using a... Alexa, how many ounces are in 16 cups? See, she's using it. I'm not. 16 cups is 128 fluid ounces. So. Alexa, I'm just how many ounces it. are in 2 cups? So, You might want to start kneading on the counter. You know what I'm doing right now? I'm literally grabbing a pinch of flour. A pinch. And I'm putting it in my hand. Want to buy some? Okay. Want a bite? No. No? 
No. Wow. Because I know you're not going to take a bite of my gingerbread man. And just knead it out. And it should be in a dough consistency right now. So you might want to dip your hands in water. First, you're going to rub it in water. I'm going to use a measuring tool to get water on it because I don't feel like using that big measuring thing. I know it's not olive oil, it's water. You use water, plus get the water on your hands. It needs to be stretchy and not ready. Plus, um, can I then after that sprinkle some powder, flour, and just rub it in to make it nice and soft and ready for you to use. Just talk to it. Don't talk to it. You're supposed to be listening to me. Because I'm properly telling you steps. Next, you're going to want to grab a, any type of mold. I really don't have gingerbread man, but we have bears at my house. I have a tree at my house. We don't have gingerbread man. This mold thing is going to be my tree. I made a tree. I need a pan. I thought I had like a big Can you get me a pan? Like a little thing for me to set my cookies on. It's well, you have to move. Mm, I don't know if I have any more. You've used all of them. Put your cookie on there and just keep on making cookies throughout the day. I'm mixing up my cookie dough, dough, dough. I'm mixing up my cookie dough. I'm flattening out my cookie dough. I'm flattening out my cookie dough. It's not a, actually cookies, it's gonna be with my gingerbread house. No, I'm making this for tonight. And I might make even more after watching this video. It should be flat. Like flat. We laid out. You can work with a little at a time maybe. To flatten it out. I'm just going all in. See. I go all in. I don't recommend it to go all in. But I still yet go all in. You're going to want to space your cookies out to these. And um, make sure your cookies are perfidies. Redities. Yeah. Perfectly made. Pretty sure I was supposed to use cooking spray on the pan, but. <laughs> you might want to use, listen to your parents. Don't do this. <laughs> so. 
Am I just making these for one minute? Okay, and that was it for the day. I'm going to still do this. Um, so, yeah.